My name is Leonardo Sandoval. Uh, I'm from Colombia. Uh, I'm finishing my PhD in the environmental infrastructure and infrastructure program of Politecnico di Milano. Um, I am a civil and agricultural engineer from the National University in Colombia. The topic of my research are regarding the technologies in the oil and gas industry. Uh, this research is motivated by the company that is sponsoring my PhD. Uh, that is a company that develops and sells technologies for uh, companies of the oil and gas industry. I developed three different projects. Uh, in the first one, I analyzed the movement or the migration of fluids in the underground. In the second part of my research, I work uh, with production location, which is a technique associated with hydrocarbons forensics. And in the third part of my research, I implemented a methodology to assess or to quantify the risk of contamination after hydraulic fracturing operations. The conclusions of my thesis are um, several conclusions actually, but the three more important are for the first project we were able to identify which are the most important features that govern the flow of gases in the subsoil. In the second project we were able to develop a novel algorithm that is more accurate than traditional uh, techniques and in addition um, allows people to reduce the experimental workload of these uh, activities. Well, the main contribution of my third project is the implementation of numerical models for the quantification of contamination of groundwater bodies using a state-of-the-art techniques to reduce the model complexity. Actually, research in energy, underground energy resources is uh, key because the global energy demand has been continuously increasing in the last decades and it's going to be like that in the, in the, next, in the near future. Which means that uh, we need to provide energy resources to society and the most realistic uh, predictions suggest that by 2050 we are going to use the same amount of hydrocarbons that we are using today. That means that we need to develop technologies, we need to provide more efficient uh, mechanisms to produce hydrocarbons in order to guarantee accessible and affordable energy resources to everyone.